It's a beautiful day in this neighborhood. A beautiful day in this neighborhood. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? Hey, Finn, what up, man? You know what time it is without on Instagram. We have an interview coming up. I want to get to the bottom of something. Shout out to the whole AFA. What up with y'all niggas, man? There's a lot going on in the battle rap that I'm listening to. I'm trying to get to the bottom of it. Just so I know for my own purposes. You think I'm going to say, here. Hit that. <coughs> oh, damn. Miss Princess, I see you. My bad, yo. <coughs> I got an interview right now, though. I got you. Yo, I'm going to start going live with y'all, man. Start doing the fan joints. You know what I'm saying? I'm just waiting for the interview to come right now, the interviewer. Yo, Miss Princess, what's up with you, yo? That's, yo, you know, that's foul, B. That's foul, Miss Princess. You know that, right? That's messed up. You just did that. I just told you I got an interview, and you just said I was full of shit. Like... Really? That's 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 foul. What you think about Mook versus Hollow? Eh, I used to be. I used to want to see it. I used to want to see it. I ain't gonna lie to you, son. Like this. I mean, I'm with it. There we go. I see him. I see him. Let's get this interview lit. Send a request. No more YouTube. What are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about, bro. Hold on. Let me send this nigga a request. She said you took my super chat and didn't read it. Well, what was the question? I didn't take a super chat. Maybe I didn't read it, but I didn't take it. Let me see what's going on. Hold on. Let me invite him. Let me invite him. Let me invite him. Damn, boy, boy. Where you at? I don't even see you in here no more. There you go. What's good, my boy? What's happening? Oh, there we go. What up, bro? What's good with you, man? What's good, boy? What's happening? Let's Listen, talk man. about it. You Look, know what we're here for? You already know. Oh, I like this. Because I was going to tell you, you know. to the point, bro. You know, like you know what it is, though, bro? Like, I was I was I was I was promoting this shit at first, right? I was promoting this shit on Twitter, on Instagram, doing my own little promotion like that. Niggas ain't have nothing to say. Wasn't nobody covering that shit. The moment some shit looked like it's about to get out of hand and shit about to go somewhere, now everybody got something to say about this shit. Well, I'll tell you right now, I ain't been on Instagram. Oh, I ain't been on Twitter for three years, number one, and I ain't mm -hmm. seen nothing on Instagram, number two. Now I'm telling you where I'm coming from because I'm probably not following it the way everybody else is. To be honest with you. Right. Now, I know you had a battle with Ill Will. Mm -hmm. Now, from what this is where I'm coming from. I know I seen you on 15 Minutes of Fame. I didn't see the whole interview. I ain't gonna lie to you. I didn't. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I know there was an envelope there. That's all I know. Now mm -hmm. I heard, not saying I'm right or not, I heard it has something to do with I don't know, Ill Will beating the baby mother up or something like that. I don't even know. You know, yeah, what I'm it's saying? the same shit, yo. This the this this the this the shit right here. So they you just know gonna... started from A to B, because I don't know what's I'm going on. When I went, when I went to, when I went to, uh, angry, uh, not angry fan. When I went to 15 minutes of fame and shit, I show Uncle Rob. If you look on the, if you look on the camera, you see Uncle Rob put out the envelope. He put out the envelope, and you look inside the envelope, you see he looking kind of crazy, like yo, this look, this going beyond battle rap, this too far, da 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 da, some shit like that. You feel me? He wasn't failing it. So I'm like, see, right, I, didn't the whole thing. I, don't, I didn't even yeah. know that part. Yeah, I said, yo, listen. He, he said, what if somebody did that to you? I said, I don't care, cause it's what I signed up for. This battle rap. Niggas come into this shit off disrespectful shit. A nigga from they set, a nigga lot of Zay put my mother on a shirt in a battle. Niggas remember that shit? Where yeah. was the rallying and the protesting then? Mm -hmm. Niggas ain't say shit about that. A nigga put a nigga mother on a shirt. It wasn't no motherfucking blogs about that. Mm -hmm. Niggas ain't say nothing about niggas ain't say he was wrong or nothing like that. I got off stage with a lot of Zay. We shook hands, got drink. Niggas was chilling. Niggas changed, changed numbers and niggas became close after that. That shit just words, just battle rap. That's how I take it. Can I ask you a question? Can I ask you a question though before you? Yeah. How did you actually feel about that? About what? 
about the, about seeing your mom's Nothing, nothing at all, bro. It's battle rap. You sign up for that. I told Uncle Rob, if that nigga would have had my mother on a shirt, busting it wide open, she put herself in that fucking position. And I put myself in a position for her to be talked about because I'm in battle rap. I decided to do that. That's what all of these niggas, yo, bro, if something, ha something happened to you, I guess years, I forgot what it was, but I know something happened with you, Piper Boy, something happened with a lot of y'all niggas as far as, like, your, uh, your wife be concerned and shit like that. You put yourself in that spot, like, you know why? Because you're an angry fan, because you're Piper Boy, because you're whoever you are. You put yourself in that position. So when you did that, you put them in that position. That's what happens. You got to accept that shit. Some niggas just want to take it so out of battle rap. Hold on, hold on. Man, One more thing, because it's lines right up with you right here, right now, right? So I did see on Facebook something happened to you when you're shorty or whatever the case may be. I don't know what happened. You hit mm -hmm. her. She says you hit her some shit like that. So yeah, you yeah. Didn't feel no kind of way. You feel like I signed up for this because I'm prepped. Yeah, I, yo, that's, that's why I didn't go crazy. I only felt the way because it wasn't true. You feel me? The shit wasn't true. And I told niggas exactly you what happened in the shit. You to that magnitude where you think anything should be able to happen to you now because you Yo, I'm a public person. figure. I'm a public figure. I decided well, to be I'm a public figure. I had fans. I had people that come up to me and want to take my picture and shit like that. I had fans. So I'm a public figure. So if, a, if they see something like that, that Nico shit probably going to be mentioned in battles. A nigga probably going to see that shit. If that shit would have blown up like it was going supposed to blow up, a nigga would have used that shit in the battles. Who I would have been mad at? I can't be mad at a nigga for bringing it up in a battle. It's a battle. It's an angle. You mm. can't be mad at that shit. So, so you, you, feel feel like, like, you feel like anything goes in the battle, no matter what. Anything. I'm just saying, no, 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 not anything. You can't talk about a nigga dead peoples. That's okay. off. That's crazy. Okay. That's just crazy. Don't talk about nobody dead peoples. Don't talk about nobody children. Like, don't talk about children. These are children. You feel me? And then just other shit like if your mother's sick. I'm not talking about your mother being sick. That's just crazy. Like, it's just certain shit that you just know this is out of hand. Like, this is out of hand, bro. Like, you can't talk about certain shit just out of hand. Like, you can't okay. talk about crazy shit. But okay, you know that. We don't got to have no contract. It's just certain shit that you just know. Like, I'm not touching on that. You okay. feel me? Like, like, if I battle B dot, his children are... uh. From the other side of the spectrum, they autistic or whatever. That's what I hear in battles. I'm not talking about your autistic children. I just won't feel right as a man doing that. That's crazy. That's too far. You feel me? It's, yeah, it's certain shit that you just like. I'm not doing that. You feel me? That's all that shit is. You feel me? But yeah, on that, on that tip, I, I, after he seen that shit, I got a call from Ike P. Ike P. Hit me. He like, yo, prep you, my nigga. I fucks with you, but I don't want you bringing out whatever's in that envelope or whatever. I'm handing some court shit. Da 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 da. I don't want you bringing that shit out because it's going to make matters worse for ill will. I told Ike P, you got my word. I'm not bringing that out. I told him this weeks ago. So it was never going to be in the battle. Okay. It was going to, when I first, when I first initially, when I first initially was going to do it. Yeah, it was. But when he told me that ill will was going through something already and this would make matters worse. I said, yo, I'm not doing it then. I'm, not, I'm just going to wrap my round. I told him that weeks ago. Okay. You feel me? So I don't know if that never got back to ill will or whatever the case may be, but I guess it didn't because the nigga still feel like do you still feel how you feel? And I can't blame ill will for feeling how you feel. You feel disrespected? Well, how, how, how does ill will oh. feel? I didn't see anything. So how does he feel? What I seen, what I seen from him was this. I seen him in an interview with uh with Uncle Ra. He's sitting in the car and he like, yo, niggas is playing with my name. You feel me? He felt like I was playing with his name doing that. But I think this is before he even knew it was an envelope. I think he thought that just by seeing the nigga name, just by seeing the nigga envelope, you like, oh, all right, this shit seemed like there's some shit. What you gonna say? I'm a snitch? You gonna say I'm this and that? You feel me? So he felt like that along with playing with his name before he even knew what was inside the shit. I'm like, all right, cool. You feel me? So that's what he felt like. Okay. But then I seen him on uh, on Instagram. He just popped up out of nowhere. Like, he popped up out of nowhere, like, two days ago, yesterday, or whatever. Popped up out of nowhere. And he, like, he under the joint, like, yeah, nigga, we still battling. My fault for ducking. I'm like, yo, you hilarious or whatever. I'm not battling no more because this shit has seemed like it's going outside of battle rap. So he, like, he like nah, you can stand in front of niggas saying whatever you want to say, whatever. I'm like, yeah, I can do that. He like, well, I can't. So that shit made me feel like, well, if you can't, then that means you don't want to battle. He said you can stand in front of people and say whatever, whatever, but I can't. Yeah, because I said, yo, I said, yo, I can stand in front of a nigga saying whatever he want to say, and then I can just leave off the stage and just, it don't matter to me. Oh, no, it doesn't he bother like, me. I got you saying. Yeah, you. he said, he said, I can't do that. He said, congrats to you, but I can't do that. That let me know right there. That made me feel like this. Yeah. It's you don't even want to battle now. Yeah, it may go left. You, you feel me? Know. It made me feel like you don't even want to battle because you're telling me right now that you can't handle that, that you're not with that. So that let me know you feel the way. So I'm not about to show up to a battle. And I'm there for a battle. I wrap my round. I stop rapping. I'm looking away from you, and you rock off on me. 
because you ain't there for a battle. Okay, so pro, can I let me ask you this? What that like? Well, obviously you only want to say it, but like, like what was it? Like I don't know. What was what? What was what? I mean, all this is around the envelope. So like, yeah, yeah. all that was around the envelope, and the envelope was like, like I told, like I told Sway. The shit you can you can count it for a rookie mistake. You feel me? A rookie mistake. A nigga got some information. I'm like, alright, look, I'm 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 popping right now. I had the EK shit. I had the JC shit. Let me do some shit that's gonna get me on a whole another level or whatever the case may be. Boom. Let me go up. Let me let me use an angle. Let me do some shit that's gonna go viral. Some shit like that. Not even thinking about okay, this shit can make a nigga whatever he dealing with in real life. It can make that shit worse. That's why when Ike P asked me not to do it, I said I'm not doing it. Cause whatever he got going on, I'm just assuming a nigga fighting something. Okay. And if he is, it's going to make it worse. So I'm not going to do it. Okay, I got you, I got you. Night P can verify that I said this to him. He can okay. verify that I said this shit to the nigga. You feel me? But then on top of that, like, the nigga seemed like he wanted to go out. So I'm like, yo, listen, if you want to go there with it, like, you want to take things there with it, I can't stop you from doing that. Only thing I can do is be prepared when you bring it my way. You feel me? I'm not a nigga that's on that type of shit. I'm, I'm way above. I'm way too mature. That's way my my. I'm way too level headed for that shit. But if you want that, I have no choice but to be on that. Like you feel me? Like Angry Fan, you can tell me like yo prep. I ain't on that type of shit. But if prep on that type of shit, go Angry Fan gonna have to get on yeah, that type yeah, of yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You better hurry up. You better get on that. You better get. Yeah. You feel me? So it's that type of shit. But like that's why I said I'm not even feeling about the battle. Got canceled twice. Now he want to do the battle. You feel me? He so wants to do the battle. We, so, so are we battle? From what I seen you say, you said the battle. You said it's over with. I'm not thinking about battling you no more. Yeah, they gave me another nigga already. They gave me another That's nigga for said. March. Yeah, they gave me another nigga for March. Then they told me, "Yo, you in Ultimate Madness," and they're trying to find some shit for uh for Double Impact for me. Okay, you wait, wait, to find wait, some wait, for Double back. Impact. You got it jumping right now. Wait a minute. You just said what? Yeah, this nigga. The this Ultimate second is a, tour is a tournament. Yeah, at Ultimate Madness Tournament, and that shit for like mad shit for more than what it was the Hold first up. time. Are you gonna look? Look, I'm not even gonna put the pressure on you to be number one because I don't know who else is in the tournament. That's my plan. Listen, I don't care who listen, in the tournament. That's my plan. To I don't want to hear shit if you're not top three. Listen, no more bro. Games. Nobody inside this tournament. First of all, these niggas don't freestyle. That's first talk, off. Talk, they don't rebuttal. That's the talk. second thing. The third thing, these niggas can't do this last minute shit like I can do. I can, yo, I'm prepared for EK in 10 days. In then 10 vote days. this shit for JC in two weeks. You see what happened? You see what JC said in the battle? He like, yo, we had two weeks for this. JC said it. That's why I said who they gave you in two weeks. Prep. I had two weeks for JC, 10 days for EK. Can I ask you a question? Like, like, you feel me? Oh, these shit, like, are you really, like, I understand you can do that. Are you really comfortable doing that? No, I don't want to do it. If a nigga, if they, if you gave me an option, like you what, yo, prep, I'm gonna give you two months or or, or, yeah. or ten days. I'm gonna ask for the two months, nigga. But I don't you, want the ten you days. Want to say, like I'm not gonna turn the bread down. I know I can do it. No, not even the bread. Like not even the bread. Just the point of if it's an opportunity, JC, an opportunity. Ain't ready to turn that shit down. You want two weeks for JC? Let me get that. I'm not ready to say no. And then JC go get another battle, and then I'm battling some nigga I don't want to yeah, battle. But look though, but what happens if you rush in two weeks and you're not even polished? Now he just smoke you. But nah, that's 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 not. I can do that, bro. I, I, that's right. why I took time. That's why I took time off for of smacking. Was traveling all around, doing all types of other shit, battling on these small leagues, battling day after day. Battle Saturday, then battle Sunday, then battle the next week. Like niggas is conditioned for this type of shit. It's like five or six niggas in battle rap who conditioned for that type of shit. And I'm one of them niggas. Mm -hmm. And them niggas in this tournament, y'all might show up in that first round and look elite. But when we get them two weeks to write for that second round, y'all niggas gonna be drained, and I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be that. Mm. So yeah, that shit gonna be crazy, bro. I'm already writing for niggas. I'm already writing for the the and three niggas that I know gonna be a problem. That UFF tournament. I ain't forget. You gotta make that you up. Said what? That UFF tournament. We making that yeah, up. Yeah, I fucked tournament. that shit up. You know why I fucked it up? Because first of all, I was immature as far as in battle. I'm immature as fuck. I was immature as shit at that time. I wasn't even practicing. Y'all was looking out the window. I see XL chess. All them niggas in the parking lot rehearsing. I'm running around fucking with the hotel bitches and the BET bitches. I'm doing shit I'm not supposed to be doing. I should have been out there with them niggas rehearsing. I'm over here fucking with the little BT camera bitches and all of that. Like I'm feeling myself, and then go up there and get smoked. That shit won't happen now, bro. From any, I don't care who in a tournament. If I lose to a nigga in a tournament, that nigga was godly. Mm. I promise you that. That nigga was godly. Okay, that's a fact. So you said that's that. a super fact. They hit you for the two on two. Yeah, they hit me for the two on two. They first, they they had a few. They first it was me and Holmesy. And then it was supposed to be me and Prez. But now it might be some off the wall shit like me and Franchise. You a franchise? Might be some what, some some out the so blue, minute, just wait, crazy wait, 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 shit. You wait, 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 feel me? What? They're picking the teams. 
Yeah, they just they just want some random shit to happen. You feel me? Because it was gonna be we was gonna do some other shit. Some uh. We was going to do like some vet, some other shit, some other shit or whatever. But it was going to be me and Sean. You feel me? Because you know I'm zipping them up now. So it was going to be me and Sean. Wait. You feel me? But now. Yeah. So you, you really are officially zip them up, gang. Yeah, yo, you don't see Sean. Ask Sean. Go, go tweet Sean and my zip them up. Go, go tweet Sean. You are officially zip them up. Go tweet Sean and my what? zip them up, man. How this happen? How did, well, he seen, he seen what I did to JC. He was in the building when I was battling JC and was like, Yo, this nigga prep is on some different shit. Like, he's on some other shit. Like, I need that energy. You feel me? And that from that point forth, it was zip him up, man. And you seen when I battled in that battle, I had on a zip him up hoodie in that battle. Mm. Versus JC. You feel me? So, shit is that, man. Shit is one of them ones. But, yeah. yo, this, this, this ill will shit, though, is like, this ill will shit just, I don't I just don't, I don't know. If you was on my end, you would see why I feel like I don't want to even go and do all that. You feel me? That's why that, now the round, you seen this round? The round drop. No. The first round drop. No, I didn't see it. Yeah, the first round dropped or whatever on um on uh what's his name on uh on Henny shit. You feel me? Fact, I'm gonna what, get what, yo. What I'm gonna that? let you know some of the. I'm gonna give you some of the. I'm gonna give you some of the. You got time? Yeah. I'm gonna give you some of the round. You tell me if this shit fight you because you keep it a hundred with niggas. So you tell me if I just stood in front of ill will with this shit I'm about to say right now, would this shit be crazy? Okay. You ready? Yeah. So I'm like yo. I thought I was your gunner, smack. That's until you start at pointing your gun at Smack. We gonna handle this accordingly. You turned your back on Smack for rare breed. You know what else is rare? Loyalty. This shit annoying me. Out of all the ways that you can move. That's what you do? You knew trying to evolve with Adam would put y'all in a bad space. I guess that didn't matter to you. You see the type of shit these niggas will do for a bag, bruh? Type of niggas you can't trust. The Pistons trying to trade three stars to get Giannis. That shows me these Detroit niggas willing to trade it all for a damn buck. That type of shit make me look at you as less of a man, bruh. Out of you and Smack, I'm trying to figure out which one of y'all more like Kaepernick. Him for making Neil famous or you because you ain't stand up. I can't front. Nigga, you's a worthy threat. I don't know what they paying you, but you deserve them checks. You went from Smack to RBE, the king of the dot, back to Smack. Nigga, you don't deserve respect. Spin the bottle. We don't know who the yak gonna turn on next. Let's get personal. February 5th, 2018, the police was called for an incident between you and your baby moms. I ain't gonna say her name. But y'all was arguing about a restraining order she had on you. You wouldn't leave. You got mad. Then you hit her three times with a 40 caliber pistol. She had a bruise over her eye and some damage to her ear. You punch on females. Smack. We shouldn't have this nigga here. How you box something that fragile? You were supposed to handle it with care. Man, I was going to smoke this nigga, man. I was going to really do this nigga bad, bro. Like, and that was just the first minute back to back bombs on this nigga, man. God damn. It was gonna get ugly, bro. So, so, all right. So, the battle's not number one. So, let me ask you a question. Do you even feel like it's the battle's the battle? Obviously, if you don't want to go left, but do you feel like the battle of that magnitude was worth it? Because it will is a name. I will say that. You're not gonna yeah, he a name, but. I hear a name, but it's like, yo, like, like I said, like I said in my, in my video. Shit, Stop on the political shit. Would you, do you feel like that shit is definitely going to go left? And would you battle this that's nigga? That's what I said. You think that's, what, that's what I said in, in my video. Look, I said in the out, video. Though, out, though. If it wasn't going to go left, would you take the battles? Yeah, I'm if it wasn't, it was ill will. He's one of the motherfucking biggest names in exactly. battle rap. Of course, exactly. I want the battle. But you think I was doing all the promo. But at the end of the day, bro, like, he feel disrespected. So if you feel disrespected, I say, well, you feel disrespected and you want to take it there, we can shoot it out with the knuckles or we can shoot it out with the gloves. Whatever one you want to do. But don't show up and make it seem like you want to battle and then you rock off. He on his okay, Instagram so the, putting okay. world star and shit like that. So, 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 so what does El Will want? An apology on camera or something? What does he want? Uh, apology for what? First of all, that's this, this is what I did apologize for if I made matters worse for him. I'm not going to apologize for some shit that was sent to me. Okay. I apologize for the, I apologize for putting you in a position where that shit probably made shit worse for whatever you got going on. If that shit made matters worse, then cool. I apologize for that part. But as far as the shit being sent to me, shorty, she ain't just sent it to me. If y'all niggas see Piper Boy blog, the niggas said that she sent it to him. She sent it to other bloggers. She sent it to niggas that he was battling and all of that. Shorty ain't just sending this shit to me. Yo, I ain't know nothing about none of this shit. It's my first time. Yeah, they said Shorty was sending this shit all around. You feel me? Like she just was, she one of them bitches. She be in the mix. 
Niggas see her at events, niggas just don't know who she is. She be at events all the fucking time. She be in the mix. You feel me? So yeah, man, like I'm not the only nigga that did that shit. But like I said, I wasn't even going to send that shit. I mean, put that shit out when niggas told me he was dealing with some personal shit. I wasn't even going to do it. I just was going to wrap my round. And that was that. And then what? Well, I guess he talked really? about video. Then you seen a video with him? No, I seen the video with him. That shit ain't make me feel no way either because I seen him in the video, but then I seen him like, he seemed like he was still joking because he did like the little jump shit like that. I That's when I made it. that you did side by side with him. Yeah, jump, yeah, yeah, jump, yeah. Like, right. like, like, you did some funny ass shit. Yeah. Yeah I, was making, yeah, I was making fun of it. Like, all right, this nigga still on some jokey shit. I we can keep it going. But then when he went on the Instagram and he was like, Nah, nigga, you said you said what you said what I'm gonna do, right? Cause I said something like in a, in a funny blog, I'm like, yo, what you gonna do if I don't play with if I play with your name? I'm saying that shit in the funny blog I did, yeah, yeah, the, the funny video. Blog, the then I jump. Yeah, I if I wanted to be serious, why the fuck would I jump in a video if I'm trying to be serious? The yeah, shit was a like joke. A, like knocking my windows open or something like that. Right, shit like that. If you made like a little joke about the shit, that trying to make the shit funny. Yeah. He took that like, oh yeah, you talking about what, what I'm gonna do if you play in my name, nigga? What? Oh, then he put oh, world star. Under the Instagram uh, video or, or whatever he did, I'm like, oh, okay, okay, we not about okay, to do okay, that. Okay, okay. Now we I ain't about to do. Ain't about to do now that. Now I see what you're saying. You yeah, ain't saying that. I didn't know all of that. Yeah, he just on his Instagram. He got he got style. Nigga saying it's just battle rap. Nah, but remember, it's just see, battle rap. World shit. star. I didn't see that. I didn't see that. Yeah, that's what he said, man. Oh, now nah, now I see what you're saying. Like, yeah, yeah. he's saying that. And as and as far as niggas saying it's a fake angle, that angle itself, forty cow and John John already said this shit. Them niggas already said this already. I'm not the first nigga to do this shit. I just took what they said and put my own spin on it. Now, if the shit that was sent to me wasn't real, that ain't me. I didn't go and go make this shit up. Like, I didn't even know this shit was a thing until Shorty brought it to my attention. I just knew the little bits and pieces from John John shit and from 40 Cal shit. I didn't know this. I didn't know what she looked like. So how can I find a picture of a bitch when I don't even know what she looked like? The fuck, I don't even know, I don't even know how to, I could have went on Google and made up a fake picture of a bitch that don't look nothing like the bitch, because I don't even know what she look like. So it don't even make sense. All right, so what's your, what you want to do? You want to call him or I mean, what you want to do? I gave, I gave Mac Myron my number and said, yo, give this to Ill Will. The nigga ain't call me. The nigga don't want to call me. I'm guessing I've been, yo, all, everything you think I could have did. I already did that. I talked to Ill Will in the inbox. I talked to Ike P and gave him my word I wasn't going to show the shit. I gave Mac Myra my number to give to Ill Will. I did all of the shit that you think I could have done. I did all that shit already. You did all that shit. You, you really yeah, just, really really just want to dead this shit like, yo, whatever, bro. I, just I mean, it got to be dead because the nigga don't want to battle. The nigga want to show up and throw hands. Or he, well, oh, he don't want to throw hands. Like, that's, that's how I feel. Either we're going to let this shit just die and just go about his business, just do whatever it got to do and just go its own way. You feel me to say, oh, fuck it, the battle done? Because Ill Will, come on, Ill Will got way bigger plates than the fucking prep. Yeah. Come on, man. So you ain't, you know, this battle ain't something you want to do. It's something you was doing on, on some giving prep a shot type shit. Like, you was giving me a shot or they was or they gave you a nice bag or whatever the case may be. You don't want to do this battle. Okay. You feel me? So we don't got to do the battle. We can let that shit die and go by this way. Niggas already, ain't nobody killing you. Ain't no cancel ill will culture. Nigga ain't call you gay. And nigga ain't say you was a snitch. Nigga ain't say you was pussy. And nigga ain't disrespect you in that manner. So we can let this shit go. But if you don't want to let this shit go, then I just got to be ready for whatever you bring my way. That's real nigga shit. Hmm. You know what I mean? That shit is damn. I don't even know it was that serious and shit. It ain't that serious with me. You know? It's that serious with me. I don't give a fuck. A nigga could do whatever. A nigga could say whatever he wants to me in a bad. Yo, when I was battling in the fucking lunch rooms and the playgrounds, the whole object was for a nigga to disrespect you. It wasn't no punchlines, no schemes, no wordplay. A nigga just had to disrespect you. Just disrespect your character. That's what it was okay, about. But prep, but prep. Isn't the problem here? The problem is that there is no line. That's the problem. Because it is a line. This is not the same way you just said. You don't talk about kids. Arsenal talks about kids. Arsenal do all of that shit. Arsenal talk about niggas' dead relatives. He talk about niggas' children. So he poured no out the top baby mother on him. It's no line, I guess, with him. There's it's no line with Arsenal. No, but there's you know other people me? like that also. They don't. They may not go as hard, but not, like no battle rapper has the same the same thoughts about this. Yeah, that's a fact. That's a fact. Well, but me, you can like say whatever you want to me. Because you got really I don't have no line. 
You gotta think I don't of, have no line. Like me, that's me. Me personally, I have lines that I that I won't cross for other people. Like I won't talk about your dead relatives, your children, somebody that's all. I mean, your mother said I won't talk about personal shit like that. I won't do that. Or if I know you, you feel me? Like I know you personally. I'm not gonna talk about shit that nobody knows about. That was never in a battle. Like you feel me? I'm about to battle drugs. I know personal shit about drugs. I'm not gonna bring that up. That's my man's. I'm not bringing that up. We're going to show up and we're going to go ball for ball. I'm not ready to do no weird ass shit and bring up shit that nobody has no clue about. That's some other suck ass shit. Well, that's, that's a no line question. I want no question. What if it wasn't drugs and it was somebody else? Would you bring like it up? Like if it was somebody that I don't know? Yeah. Yeah, if it was somebody I don't know, like, yeah. Like if, uh, if I was battling fucking Arsenal, you feel me? And I want to talk about it. I'm going to talk about I'm going to cross every line with Arsenal because Arsenal don't give a fuck. But that's what so I'm saying yeah. about. There's no line. So you never, like, yeah, no, that, you just go. No, because Battle because by there's, battle, a, there's a line of there's a line of what you're willing to do. Like me, I'm not willing to cross certain lines. Like I wouldn't talk about murder mook mother. That shit obviously is a touchy subject. And then I just won't do it, period. Even if it wasn't a touchy subject, I just won't talk about your dead mom. That's crazy. I just won't do that. But if somebody talked about my dead mom, I'm uh -huh. not doing nothing. I don't care. Okay. That's just me. Like on coming to me, I have no line. I have no line of what line you can cross with me. Okay. But yeah. I have a line that I'm not gonna cross. You feel me? That's the difference. You're comfortable with that? With what? With the fact that with, with it's already. Well, I mean, I don't know. It's not disadvantage. I'm just saying. Say well, as far I mean, as far as like what somebody like saying whatever to me. Yeah. Yeah, I don't care. I don't, I don't care because I just me that shit is words. But like, yo, if I if I go into a battle and like I'm like, yo, let, let's say I go into this battle and then a nigga say something crazy to me and I rock off on this nigga, that shit turns to some beef and then I end up dying over that shit because I don't or I end up killing nigga and I get out and I get locked up for life. Now I'm away from my daughters and my fucking mom and my my family and all of that over some words, over some fucking rhymes. You know how dumb I'ma feel, how stupid I'ma feel that I could have avoided that shit. That's just how I look at it. I'm not about to put my life on the line, my freedom on the line because of some rhymes. No, that's not worth it to me. I but other it. niggas don't look at shit like that. You feel me? It's different. All right, all right, all right. That's where I'm at with it, man. You had said something else. So you said it was the, the Ultimate Madness Tournament, the two on two. Ultimate Madness Tournament. Yeah, this Ultimate this Ultimate Madness got niggas that y'all that y'all don't think is in there. It ain't got no no disrespect to niggas, but it ain't no nun nuns. It ain't about. It ain't no. It ain't no you. I don't know. It ain't no. It ain't no names like that. It ain't no. I mean, none nuns. It ain't no Reaper Rouse. Ain't no Ooh. no like Jada Nightwing popping now. But ain't no Jada Nightwings. We first started no Fonz. It ain't nothing. It ain't no new niggas. Uh, no disrespect to them niggas because them niggas fire. But it ain't no new niggas. Okay. It's niggas of that caliber. It's niggas on that that shine caliber. That nitty caliber. That twerk caliber. That that they feel me. That old red J C. That this up there. Uh, this niggas upstairs. Okay. This one of those. Okay. You know okay, what I mean? okay. It's one of those. Yeah, bro. And that shit one of them right there. And you won that huh? tournament. Yeah, I'm in that tournament. I'm in that one. Yeah, nice. that's Ultimate Man 3. I'm in Ultimate Man 3. That's a fact. Okay. I'm in that one. Nice. I don't know when nice. I don't know when the shit, nice. but it's coming up soon. It's coming up. It ain't it's not even it ain't even a full three months away, but they, they showed y'all the little the little menu of how everything going with caffeine. Y'all seen yeah. that shit? Yeah. Well, it's well, coming well, up. Well, this shit coming up. This shit coming up, man. Ultimate Madness. Then I got the March shit. Then I got the motherfucking uh then I got the double impact shit. You feel me? I don't know who it is. We're going against it. Me and Franchise wanted Loso and Saga, but they said, now nah, they got somebody else for them, so we're going to pick some other niggas. Whoever else they got, it don't even matter. You feel me? We on that shit. wanted Loso and Saga? Yeah, me and Franchise are going to go against Loso and Saga. You feel me? We was going to do that. You feel me? We both went against them niggas. We all went against each other already anyway. You feel you me? So. What? You know what? I'm glad I got you up here. I interviewed Big Cannon last, uh, last week. And we yeah, that's a big bro. The top five rebuttalists. And I both oh, yeah. Um, there's a lot of y'all when you really think about it. It's, it's a cool. lot, ain't a lot, ain't a lot of elite niggas though. Like it's like you got, you got Trez, you got A Ward, Hollow. you got, you got Sharon. I don't Hollow not in it for me. Hollow not Hollow. really like Hollow is not Hollow not somebody who like uses that as a strength. Can he do it? Yeah, he can do it, but he was never one of the one like somebody who like could just did it every battle. He's not somebody who do it all the did it all the time. Chef Trez do that shit every battle. A Ward every fucking battle. Sharon every battle. These this is like an attribute that these niggas don't let go. You feel me? Like I like I do this shit. DNA to me DNA is like one of the best freestylers. Period. 
Yeah. Always going to be that to me. Until a nigga can do what he did, until a nigga can say, give me a word, and then freestyle haymakers off of that, you not over DNA to me. Yeah. That shit is, that's some yeah, other shit to do. to do. Yeah. Yeah, that's some, other, that's some other shit to do. Until a nigga do that, then you not, you ain't over DNA to me. But then they like DNA, like you got DNA, uh, I don't got DNA, but then Big Cannon when he want to be on that type of time. And then Bangs, of course, Bangs can freestyle a whole battle. Like Bangs did freestyle the whole battle before you feel me. Like whether you think it's dope or not, that's up to you. But yeah, he didn't did that shit. But like I know, and I think I, in order, like right now, I feel like A Ward the best right now, cause A Ward is cooking shit right now. You didn't like, say Charlie Clips. I don't think Charlie Clips one of them ones either. Like that's what like yo, Charlie probably rebuttaled like what like once. Like get like he well he freestyled against he freestyled against who was it? Charlie Sirius said, Jones and X Factor. Charlie seemed like. He don't. Sirius Jones with the girl with the stretch marks. Yeah. And then act back to when he freestyled like 10 minutes or some shit like that. Okay. That's it. That's all. Whatever which, whatever one he did it in. Like what other battle he did it in. So, so, uh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. So, you're talking about people who rebuttal, but they're like straight haymakers? I'm t yeah, I'm talking about niggas who rebuttal when it's like, they. this is what they do. Like, they do this shit. This is a strength of theirs. Like, you're not going to see an A war battle when he don't rebuttal. I'm gonna see that. You're not gonna see a trans battle when he don't rebuttal. This is what they do. Like Sharon, Sharon is gonna rebuttal. This is just what he does. You feel me? This is just something that niggas like. This is what they do. Like it's other niggas who can do it. Like disaster can freestyle, but we're not gonna put him in that category. Why? We're not gonna put disaster in that category. He don't do that shit. He can freestyle. He don't be rebuttaling niggas like that. Like, when have you seen... That's going to be one din disaster rebuttal, like, ever in his whole career. Like, one rebuttal. When he battled... None. Sleep. He rebuttaled in that battle? Like, what do you say? You might as well say it was when he battled the fan. When he told him to the fan in the crowd, that's the first... That's a freestyle. It's a freestyle. Okay. He can freestyle his ass off. He can freestyle his ass off. He don't do it a lot, but he can freestyle his ass off. But I'm not ready to put him up there with A-Ward and Trez. Them niggas be rebuttaling uh, haymakers. Uh, wow. l Mac. Ilmac okay, is fire. Right, you know Ilmac is fire right. with you know it. You know what? You are right. We got to... Def All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Because you have rebuttals, rebuttlers, then you have freestylers. We you have freestylers. We was actually talking about both me and Big Cannon. But now I see what you're saying. You mean straight yeah, like, rebuttlers. Like, free, like freestylers. Freestyling is different. Like, I would probably put a Ward and Trey's above me when it comes to like, why well, put a Ward above me with the rebuttal? A Ward rebuttals be like thought, they be well thought out. And I had some shit like that before, but he doing it more consistent than me. But as far as freestyling, I don't think these niggas can do that. I'm talking about coming into a battle and just picking shit across the room and picking shit from the crowd and with nigga outfit. That shit, I can do that shit at a drop of a dime. I don't see a Ward and Trey's and them doing that shit. But rebuttals, them niggas is elite with that shit. Okay. Them niggas is top of the line with that shit, 100%. You feel okay. me? They will come to you out, bro. Stop playing too, bro. Like, take the battle with a nigga for the free or whatever, just to be on volume as a gnome or something or whatever. Take the battle. Then after that, your bag gonna be crazy. Stop fucking playing. Bro. Whoever telling you... Is that the reason why he's not on you, bro? Yeah, they say he ain't battled real sick because it wasn't no bag. That's just what I heard on another blog. I never really... I don't know this shit, but that's what I heard or whatever that chef... I mean, why you... Real sick on volume? You should have did that for free, bro. That was That's gonna be your first URL debut. You should have yeah. did that for free. You should have definitely. I'm pretty sure Loso took Scotty for free because it was on Gnome. I'm yeah. pretty sure he did that. You feel me? Like, come on, bro. Like, let's let's be real. Like, come on, bro. Yeah, yeah. You gotta sacrifice sometimes. You gotta sacrifice. You would you have done that shit if you was able you to took real sick on value? Yeah, I probably would have too. This is, this I have did that shit, bro. I would have did that shit. I did that shit. hundred percent. That shit hundred percent. But shit, bro, that's where that's where we at with it though, bro. That's my that's my piece on it. I like I just did that. I mean, I just said that shit to you. So that shit about to be everywhere. When you want angry fan shit, this shit about to be this shit about to be <laughs> everywhere. You feel me? So that shit is that though, bro. Keep in tune. Stay in tune with a nigga, bro. I swear I'm my left, bro. Hey, 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 I appreciate you coming on, Yurt. She appreciate you, bro. You got it. Salute, bro. Damn, I didn't even know about none of that to keep it a hundred with y'all. That's wild right there. So it will not, it will not play in that shit. Like, all right, I see what's going on. Like. So I think, I don't know. Oh, we ain't say Iron Solomon. You right. We, yo, I don't know if I agree with Disaster, to be honest with you. I don't, I don't know if I agree with that. Disaster can rebuttal, bro. I've, I know I've seen him rebuttal before. I see what he's saying, but I think this definitely can rebuttal. But, yo, I'm about to get this on YouTube, you heard? And then I got one more interview, too, coming to get ready to come on Instagram. So I'm coming right back.